guztioi eta ongi etorri euskaira. Eusko jaurlaritzan... Good morning everyone and welcome to the best country. I want to thank you on behalf of the Basque government. Thank you for participating in this uh, conference on uh, the T. We have organized this uh, conference um, that we believe will benefit everyone here and also those that are uh, following us uh, online. I would like to thank the General Secretary of uh, the T of the Ministry, the different uh, members of the European uh, Union, as well as the uh, Minister from Asturias and others are from uh, different autonomous communities and uh, different uh, continents. Also, a uh, businessman, Confe Basque, Aderi. Thank you, all uh, colleagues. It's a pleasure to be here in this room full of people that are uh, passionate uh, about uh, vocational education and training. We have before us uh, two days that will be very intense, uh, but uh, also uh, very interesting. We will be listening, making proposals, and sharing experiences. What's true is that history shows that values change when we rethink how we want to live. The future allows us to redefine the concept of uh, progress. The advance of technology um, takes us towards a world that is based on two basic uh, pillars, and that is uh, sustainable human development and social cohesion. It is clear that a new reality is arising. We need to find a new way of understanding life, and we need to be prepared to take these changes in a calm manner. My great uh, friend and uh, former uh, Minister of Education and uh, physicist that you all know, Pedro Miguel Echenique, said in this uh, months of a uh, pandemic that we all use the concept of solidarity. Solidarity with our elders, solidarity with the uh, countries uh, we need to work on in cooperation. But there is a, a term in the sphere of solidarity that hasn't been used, and that is uh, the future. That means helping the youth, helping them with the adequate means. And the means are education, science, technology, and development. That means development understood as knowing how to do more by using less. We will have to coexist with digitization, connectivity, artificial intelligence, data, technologies that will demand a, a progress that will mean a new way of living. Nowadays, robots already interact with uh, machines, people, and collaborate amongst them. And technology will continue to progress very quickly. The Basque Country VET is uh, preparing the professionals that will provide a response during the present but also in the future. Through these last years, we focused on the development of a high-performance VET, transforming learning spaces, introducing the culture of innovation and creative routines, and also providing support to a production fabric, specifically SMEs, by helping them with innovating to uh, have new products and new processes. But now we have to give a step forward towards the, the new applied uh, intelligence uh, environments. We are not in a world of uh, predictable changes, but in a world of disruptive change. This means we need to be innovative since uh, we're learning. We're putting in place a smart uh, VET that provide a response to the challenges 
of the uh, fourth industrial revolution, working in different 4.0 environments, developing digital transformation, working with artificial intelligence and smart system in sectors like the industry and advanced manufacturing, biosciences, health, uh, persistent farming, gastronomy, the automotive sector, and also the textile sector. We want uh, colleges that reinforce sustainability, inclusion, as, as I said before, solidarity. The uh, BET uh, colleges in the Basque Country have always been the core of our success with the great work of their management teams and the effort made by the teachers. Now we need to continue progressing towards a new transformation that allows us to confront the big challenges of the present that will be multiplied in the future. And therefore, our colleges become smart organizations that work on an ongoing transformation that confront and provide rapid and effective responses to changes and new challenges doing so in the adequate manner. And we've seen this uh, through the results we've obtained up till now. The colleges will deploy their activities in different fields. They will become organizations mm, looking towards the future with the capacity of uh, creating new ideas and putting them in place, always taking risks, working on ongoing innovation and understanding that a new way of doing things is possible and always with our support. We need innovative responses. We need to be agile and we need to continue working as we have up till now and even more in a collaborative manner. The collaboration between different centers is one of our main strengths because we know, we all know that uh, learning and knowledge grows when we share it. BT colleges are a big pillar, a pillar that makes sure that we will have a future or a welfare um, and, uh, as I was saying, a future for our society. You're an example of commitment, uh, effort, hope, and uh, work. We face uncertain and complex uh, times, and the best society needs us. We need you. And you will always have our support, and what's even more important, our respect. Thank you all for the work you're carrying out and for everything you've uh, achieved up, up till now. In this International Congress, we will share knowledge and experiences. The experts will speak of different uh, advanced sectors. We will uh, talk about different uh, ideas, and we will address uh, very interesting subjects. Thanks for your attention. I hope you enjoy your time in the Basque Country and in San Sebastian, and that you can really uh, benefit of this conference. And I wouldn't like to finish without thanking the whole team, the whole family of the education department, all the uh, deputy ministers, delegates. We're all a team. And together with all our schools, colleges, centers, we're all a big team. And as I said, I would like to finish by once again, quoting my friend Pedro Miguel, and he said, real influence is not modeling the spirit of another so that it, uh, he or she is like us, but in having an artist and helping the artist so that each of us can sculpt his own work, even if it's something that goes against our wishes. Thank you.